Greetings everyone, and welcome to a new ASMR Gaming News Fortnite Daily Item Shop video. So let's take a look what's new on the item shop. Oh, we got the Bright Gunner back. Nice, nice. The rest of the set is back too. There's a new emo, Primo Moves. By the way, I already know what this one is. It's based on, well, first, if you're picking anything up, be sure to use code ASMR Gaming. But let's go check this email out. This one right here, yup, it's the dance. Take it to the max. Uh, as soon as I saw this on the item shop, I tweeted about it. So if you check my uh, most recent tweet, it should still be up. But yeah, this right here is uh, the Molly Ringwall dance. Uh, she's an actress. She was in this movie called The Breakfast Club. And one of my favorite scenes in that movie is like this dance scene in the library. And this dance right here is the dance that she does in that movie. So I was like, my mind was completely blown because as soon as I saw it, I was like, wait a second. Is that The Breakfast Club dance, the one Molly Ringwald did? And here it is in the game. So I'm buying it because I love that movie. I love that dance. And it looks super cool in Fortnite. The music is great. So yeah, Primo moves. Take it to the max. <laughs> it's just a really fun, catchy, kind of upbeat dance. Imagine doing this dance like after you eliminate a player or something at the end of the game. Oh, I'm going to be using this so much. <laughs> Take it to the max. Definitely worth 500 V-Bucks. Even if you don't know the Breakfast Club movie or you don't know who Molly Ringwald is, it doesn't matter. Uh, this is still a great dance. I think everyone should get this one for sure. It's, it's, it's good. It's good. The music is catchy. Go check it out on the item shop. Uh, <laughs> yeah, good dance. Good dance. Uh, let me see. What should I equip that on? Uh, let's take off Steamed for a bit. Let's put this one. Okay. So let's go through the entire item shop. Ravage is back. Uh, circling overhead, Shrouded by Night, part of the Nevermore set, Ravage skin, the female raven skin. She comes with the Dark Wings back bling, which is also quite cool. Look at these. Very popular back bling, by the way. Uh, swoop in and take the spoils. And then this legendary skin comes with a contrail, which is special. The Dark Feathers contrail, free fall in style. That looks very nice. Here is the Iron Beak Harvesting Tool, 800 V-Bucks, peck away. It's animated as you can see, there's like feathers flying off it, dark purple mist. When you strike, there also is a purple mist explosion of feathers, so that's awesome. Sound is very loud, a loud and powerful sounding harvesting tool. Design is great, so for 800 V-Bucks, I'd say this is definitely worth it. Feathered Flyer is back. Pretty basic looking glider, aside from the huge wings that come out the center, that makes it pretty cool and awesome, so if you like that, check this out. Uh, it's back, winged victory, the feathered flyer glider. And then of course we have the raven skin. Oh geez, remember in season 3 when this one came out, how crazy everyone was about it. Brooding master of dark skies, 2000 V-Bucks, still kind of an iconic Fortnite skin. Comes with the Iron Cage back bling. There is no escape. Part of the Nevermore set. Good back bling. Uh, kind of creepy though, because there's... I don't know what happened in there. But the skin itself is awesome. I like the glowing eyes the most. The hoodie with the glowing eyes. That's like the iconic look. Uh, over here we got Suki back. Yes. Unpredictable and unforgiving. Part of the Kata Tech set. Introduced in Season 9. Great, great skin. Suki. Uh, really like the skin. 1,200 V-Bucks. Comes with the Tana back bling on the edge. If you don't have any other sword or katana back bling, this is the one to get. I mean, it's really, really cool. It combos well with a lot of uncommon skins. Really, really good back bling, especially if you like swords and stuff. On the edge. And the skin itself, she's like a cyborg, robot, schoolgirl, you know, it's inspired by like Japanese anime, stuff like that. So if you're into that, this is definitely the skin for you. It's the reason why I got it, because we love anime and cool back bling. Next is the Power Punch, a harvesting tool that not a lot of people have. And yet everybody always asks me, where did you get that? What harvesting tool is that? Just because it looks awesome. Overload them, part of the Kata Tech set. It literally looks like an Iron Man, like, 
fist here, like his arm impaled on a spike, and it's like glitching out, there's electricity surging through it, uh, the green part is supposed to be blood, I guess, but you know, they have to make it family friendly for Fortnite, so it's like green liquid goo, and yeah, when you strike with it, there's like a green explosion, sound is great, and design is super cool, uh, I highly, 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 highly recommend this, uh, harvesting tool. It's in my top 10 favorite harvesting tools, and I will be doing a video on my top 10 favorites very soon. Here is the Stinger Wrap. Okay, wrap for 300 V-Bucks. It goes with the uh, other skin that I'm about to show you all. Uh, the color is interesting on this. Like, if you notice slightly when you turn, the color seems to change almost as like a shiny, shimmery surface, kind of like an oil spill. You know, if you spill like car oil on like the pavement or something it kind of like changes color depending on how the light hits it that's what this reminds me of looks kind of nice though and then here is copper wasp Cop copper wasp has returned yet again karate master known for his vicious sting uh i this one is okay but i always feel like tsuki is the better skin comes with the striped stalker back bling nunchucks in the mouth of a tiger awesome back bling ready to pounce and he's like a martial arts fighter here, and his outfit is made of the same material of the wrap over here. So, matches perfectly. So that entire set is back. Rainbow Smash has returned, a fan favorite harvesting tool. People love this one ever since it first came out. Beat the stuffing out of them. Rainbow Smash, part of the Sunshine and Rainbow set. 1,500 V-Bucks, it's animated. There's like sparkles flying off it when you strike. Uh, there's like... No unique animation, but there's already animation on the front, so I guess, I guess that counts. <laughs> uh, sound is great, really nice sounding harvesting tool, and just look at the design of this. It's a llama with the uh, sparkles and shimmering like stuff flying off it. Nice, definitely. If you have the bright bomber, bright gunner, uh, you need to get this one. Bright blimp is back as well. A thousand two hundred V bucks. It's an okay glider, rainbow powered. <laughs> Look at this. Are you seeing this? Uh, I don't know what to think of this glider. Like, it's an inflatable blimp, so I'm not really that into it, but it does look awesome if you have this paired with the Bright Gunner or Bright Bomber. It goes perfectly since it's part of the set. Uh, I like how it deploys. It just, like, explodes. Like, boom. <laughs> so that's, that's everything. There's even, like, missiles underneath the clouds here. The sprinkle clouds. <laughs> Here's the Bright Bomber. Probably one of the most iconic Fortnite skins ever. Like, people that don't even play Fortnite recognize Bright Bomber as kind of like the unofficial Fortnite mascot. Up there with, like, the, uh, Raptor, Rex skin, uh, Shadow Ops, maybe, Cuddle Team Leader, Raven skin. Like, those are very, very popular Fortnite skins, and Bright Bomber's definitely, like, number one up there. The future looks bright. A thousand two hundred V-Bucks. I have the skin. Great skin. Uh people still haven't gotten bored of this skin, like, it's still very popular, you still see Bright Bomber in every game, uh, great skin, definitely recommend, if you like Fortnite and you don't have this skin, I feel like this is one that everyone should have in their locker at some point, uh, definitely worth the price, uh, good, good skin, good skin, and then here is the Bright Gunner, he came out a little bit later, I have this one on my other account, look on the bright side, part of the Sunshine and Rainbow set introduced in Season 3, uh, I like the design on his shirt here with, like, the teddy bear with the guns. It's pretty cool. He also has, like, star tattoos on his arm. Can't really see them right now, but yeah, they're there. Uh, his outfit is just as good as the Bright Bomber. Plus, he comes with the Bright Bag back bling, which is special. Don't forget to pack a smile. Part of the Sunshine and Rainbow set. Look at this. This back bling, a lot of people buy this skin and then just use this back bling on the Bright Bomber because it goes part perfectly together. But a good back bling. I really like this back bling. There's like a zipper with like a bunny on it. Design of like llama on a rainbow and stars in the back. Good skin. Oh yeah, you can see the tattoos on his arm better now. See, he has like three star tattoos. And then we're back to Rainbow Smash. Uh, Flatfoot is back. I didn't even know that she was back. And yet I have uh, Flatfoot equipped. Interesting. Uh, so Flatfoot has returned. She's basically a Die Hard reference skin. If you know John McClane, you know Bruce Willis in the Die Hard movie, this skin is a reference to that movie. 
stay on your toes. She's like a barefoot police detective that's obviously in a lot of uh, danger, trouble, been through some stuff because of all these scratches and dirt on her. Here is the easy reach back bling with a duct tape pistol to your back. That's pretty cool for sticky situations. Also, apologies for any background noise. Nothing I can do about that. Um, but yeah, the back bling is awesome. This is a reference to the movie Die Hard as well. John McClane duct tapes uh, weapons to his back uh, to take out the bad guys so they don't see him. So good skin, good reference. Love Flatfoot. Definitely get this one. Bullseye is back. I never miss part of the bullseye set introduced in season six. Uh, 800 V bucks. Great uncommon skin out of I don't know 10 uncommon skins. This is definitely in my top 10. Uh, I love the design on the shirt here of the bullseye. Nice hair color, fun skin. I like the colors with like these uh, straps around like your thigh here, the blue and the yellow. Kind of nice colors, you know. Very colorful uncommon skin. Most of them are kind of bland. This is a really nice and colorful one. I never miss. Uh, glow Sticks is back. Wow, it's been a while. Make it glow. When's the last time this was out? Are you kidding me? Make it glow introduced in season seven. This feels like forever. Did this come out? Wait, let me see. Summertime. <laughs> I feel like I should get this like right now just because who knows when this is coming back. Let me know if I should get glow sticks because I do like the music and I like this like crazy hand movement with like, <laughs> uh, it's a good one. I think I might get this later if the people in the comments tell me to. Wow, I have not seen that in a while. Uh, Rage Quit is back. Great uncommon emote. You literally throw a controller and then kick it. Ooh, you know what? That probably hurts doing barefoot. Watch out, flat foot. That does not look fun. I'm out. <laughs> 200 V-Bucks, though. If you have 200 V-Bucks, I think you owe it to yourself to get this one. Uh, really, really good one. Great, great emote for an uncommon emote. I feel like every gamer can relate to this one. <laughs> it's funny. And then we have the Plunger Iconic. Fortnite harvesting tool that apparently Ninja inspired to get put into the game. It's a katana, Ninja katana, through a plunger. The competition is circling the drain. Came out in season two. Still very popular. No unique animation when you strike. Design is awesome, and the sound is really, really good. I like the sound. So yeah, that is everything on the item shop today. So thank you all for listening, for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all next time. So long and farewell.